family is speaking out, saying they're happy the woman who hit and killed a local mom of six will finally spend some time behind bars. They say it's not as much time as they were hoping for, but something needed to be done after the drunken hit and run that took their loved one's life. News 6's James Barbero was there for the emotional day in court. Back in handcuffs and now being fingerprinted, Susanna Norris is found guilty of the DUI that took the life of Passion Lucas. Judge Judy Atkins sentencing the 50-year-old who is known in Port St. John for starting a horse rescue to six months, half of that time in jail. The other three months Norris can choose to spend in a treatment program. You didn't offer no kind of aid, Susanna. You did nothing to help my sister. Before emotional testimony from the Lucas family, Norris told the court she knew she was impaired. Last summer, Norris told police she was drinking at Cocoa Village bars before hitting Lucas, who was walking along Industry Road. Norris's blood alcohol results were more than twice the legal limit. Before Passion Lucas is hit and killed, yes. you're concerned about potentially getting stopped for DUI. Yes. But you don't stop. I didn't stop because I was afraid of getting a DUI. Okay. And, and, and I know is. that's terrible. The Lucas family says they remain unhappy with how the case was initially investigated and later prosecutors dropping a charge of DUI manslaughter, but they are happy leaving court to see Norris get jail time. She took my daughter away from me. She took my daughter away from her sixth kid. I know it's not much time, but just the fact that something has been done. And the Lucas family tells us they are still pursuing a wrongful death lawsuit against Norris as well. In Brevard County, I'm James Sparvero, getting results new six.